are back here on Girl Talk. Stephanie Collar has joined us from WHHI. Matt Peebles has joined us, looking handsome and dapper today from Hilton Head wow. Lakes. <laughs> and, and we have called a special session today, and I think it's really exciting. True? Talk yes. to us a little bit about what we're doing with Matt today. Well, I think um, we've heard some things out there about Hilton Head Lakes, and there's some maybe some common misconceptions. We thought it would be kind of cool to invite you on the show to address some of the things that, that are kind of floating out there and, mm -hmm. uh, you know, kind of clarify what's, what's truth and what's myth. We are Shall always we yes, exactly. <laughs> We are myth busters today. We are myth busters. <laughs> but one thing that I've noticed about Hilton Head Lakes is that, you know, you're coming off of 95, you see the beautiful signage yes. for this community. And then, you know, you, you hear a little bit about it, but you don't hear enough. So, and everything that we're hearing may not be accurate. So, so but we figure we'll hear it right from uh, the sales director's mouth and we'll, we'll go from there. <laughs> I think one of the things that um, we put a little list together Yeah, we here. did. The first one is about taxes. Yeah, I mean, it, and it's, that is a fact. That's not a myth. You know, the taxes in Jasper County are higher than Beaufort County. However, um, when you compare the, what we call the total freight, you know, right. our dues are much lower, homeowners insurance is lower in Jasper County. Oh, when you okay. add everything up and quite frankly, we're generally a lot lower on the house price. So mm -hmm. it, you know, when you put it all together, you know, we're, we're a tough value to beat. And, but you know, there's a lot of rumors going around and that's the first thing that our customers hear if they go somewhere else, oh, you don't want to buy out there. You I know, the taxes are, are high. I, I did know that, but like you're saying, you have to look at the whole picture. I guess so, I'm so in love with the houses and the models. Everything shows I so I love well. the pool. I do, too. <laughs> yeah. I really do. Talk to us a little bit about a couple of the other myths that are going around. I know that there's... Um, Is about, it about that's being banked? Exactly. Bankrupt, or? Citizens bankrupt. <laughs> yeah, that's a good one. Uh, you know, when we had never been bankrupt, and we were the original developers of the lakefront side, but, you know, tradition had problems like so many developments mm -hmm. did during the recession, and, you know, we were very fortunate uh, to have the capital to purchase tradition, and you know, they paid cash for it and, and then at the same time paid all the notes off on the, the you know, the, the side we were developing from the from the start. So, right. no, we never went bankrupt. Oh, so like the, the tradition, the financial issue is something that has now kind of attached itself to you, to you Correct. all. But it's but, but you wrong. guys pulled transition wrong. back up. You <laughs> saved transition. Oh, absolutely, and it's it's doing really well right it's now. It's great. It, it's the golf side gives you an extra amenity. There's some water in there too. It's it's beautiful. Talk to us a little bit, if you will, about the schools. Um, they're being out there. Well, they're, the schools are a, a struggle, you know, and I don't mind saying we, you know, young couples with families are really not who you know we are. They're not attracted to us, right. probably for that Who issue. Who is your demographic? Um, we work mainly with baby boomers. I'm okay. leaving tomorrow morning for Washington, D.C., or excuse me, Jersey, to do a real estate show. And most of the people that we market and some of the other communities, will be 40 communities there, mm -hmm. you know, they're all after the same people. You know, getting a young buyer is not really in our profile right okay. now. Hopefully, we got great people on the city and the county council, okay. finally. Good. And, and they are absolutely on focused on the education in Jasper County and reducing property taxes. So, you know, the city's mm -hmm. coming up with a five-year comprehensive plan to do exactly that. And then, you know, that'll be fantastic for us. Citizens Homes uh, was your original builder, and there was some rumors around there about them going bankrupt as well or having some financial <laughs> issues. Yeah, I guess when people say bad things about you, you must be doing pretty right. good. But, <laughs> but, uh, or else they're just grasping. <laughs> You know what or I mean? It's just like, oh, right, I'm just going to hurt that's it somewhere, exactly right. and then they take it right. as fact and they tell somebody else, and, and it was never true to begin with. Right. No, Citizens uh, was purchased by Benchmark Homes out of California. Benchmark is terrific. Great for us. They've given us the capital to do a lot of things we didn't have the capital before to do, or Citizens didn't. And uh, they're ranked number four in the country in customer service. And I want to ask something really positive. From what I understand, Rumor has it <laughs> that sales are actually really excellent. How are you all doing? Believe it or not, I have 30 houses under construction now, either custom homes 30. or our builds, 30. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, it took us a long time to get to 100 families out there. So, it, you know, we're doing real well. And I think prices in Bluffton have gone up so fast in the last year, which is great. Uh, people are now starting to say, hey, man, we better come out there and take a look at it because we get more bang for the buck out there. And when you talk about out there, 
Yeah. You know, there's people say, oh, you're way out there. Like but, Stephanie said at the beginning. You know, the proximity mm -hmm. is awesome. It is. I community I worked for for 13 years before I moved here was out, way out there. Was and, out there. And, <laughs> but this place, I mean, tomorrow, you would, tomorrow 40 communities will be in there, and I'll guarantee you nobody has as good a location as we do. And i got to right. pitch it just for a second. If you haven't been out to Hilton Head Lakes, it really is worth going out to see. The models are amazing, and I was just shocked in some when I went out there. There's a lot of great things. It's great stuff. Stay with us. We'll be right back. There's more to come here on Girl Talk.